So now that we're up in the higher end of, of the steel category in the Rockwell hardness scale, basically what's going on is these steels are roughly the same hardness if this one is possibly not, maybe just a little bit harder. Uh, so they're just not going to cut. I mean, two steels that rub up against each other, they're just going to wear each other out. So the only ones left in the playing field are carbide cutters. This is the rim grit, or the, I mean, the uh, carbide grit. And we have the carbide tooth one still left in the game too. So go ahead and see what this does. carbide cut stainless steel yes it will um, it's gonna take a while and you're gonna have sore arms if you do very much of it uh, but it will at least do it so let's see I didn't see any damage on this thing Let's see here. So it does look like it started to pack up. And basically what I mean by that is, <clears throat> if you look at the grit down here at the bottom where it was doing the most cutting, um, it's starting to fill up and gum up. Whereas out here, uh, it's not. Then I'm trying to pull it back, but these thin blades, they get hot, the metal up here gets hot. And then as soon as they bind, they flex. And that's when it starts flapping around all over the place. That's why these thicker blades are better. Uh, when in, especially when you use them in longer ones But it did cut it so if you need to cut stainless knife steel uh, Those will do it